Despite efforts to stem the tide of overdose deaths among drug users, the numbers continue to rise locally and across the state. And now a new public service announcement is coming out, which hopes to curb addiction before it even happens. Channel 2's Dave McKinley spoke with the Western New York Prevention Resource Center about its latest effort. Those involved in the fight against opioid addiction and substance abuse are still waging that battle with messages. The tack of their message, though, this time is somewhat different. The PSA features a former UB football player, Alec Newts, who developed an addiction to pain medication following an injury. The National Institutes of Health claim 75% of addictions are starting with prescription meds, either prescribed by a doctor or taken without authorization, before users who get hooked on them run out of prescriptions and sometimes then turn to drugs like heroin, which when laced with fentanyl can be deadly. They also say when many of us see a doctor, we are ingrained to follow doctor's orders and that while we should still do that, we should also be asking questions. Do I need this medication? Is a non-opioid alternative treatment available? How long will I take the medication? When will I know to stop? What are the side effects? Will it impact other medications I'm currently taking? I really had no idea of the true danger of addiction, and that's definitely something I wish I would have known about before taking that first pill. This group could have gone a number of ways with its current messaging. Tonight at 5.30 on the town hall, we'll get into why they decided this particular one would be the most effective for the Times. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.